Roman is now going to build a global rental marketplace from scratch in under five minutes. Good luck. Wow. Good morning, everyone. I'm always up for a challenge, so let's set a timer and get started. Perfect. Say we want to build a marketplace to let travelers rent beautiful homes around the world. Homeowners can list their place on the platform and get paid. We're calling it Caval. The only thing that developers love more than writing code is not writing code, so we've created a whole new set of samples. We provide these samples to let anyone get a SaaS or a marketplace started from scratch without doing days of research, but also to help developers with established integration find building blocks that use our best practices and code patterns. Here is, for instance, an example of a Connect marketplace that sounds pretty close to what we want to build. In addition, we're launching a brand new command line interface to improve Stripe's developer experience. This CLI is a great companion that brings powerful tools right inside your command prompt. You can just type Stripe, and here we go. It has a ton of amazing features, and just to name a few, you can now interact with any part of the Stripe API, debug your code with live logs, and even receive webhook events locally on your machine with the built-in proxy. And we'll actually, uh, we're actually going to see that uh, in action in a moment. Great. So let's use the CLI to actually start our marketplace. That command is now copied, so let's uh, name it Cavon. Here we go, and press Enter. Now the next step for me will be to choose the language of the server. In this case, I'm going to pick Node. And right there, we're cloning a project, setting up the marketplace using our Stripe account, so the scaffolding, environment variables, the branding, and everything else is automatically set up for me using my API keys. So we can navigate inside the folder now. And we can even open that uh, project on VS Code. Here it is. And that's the index page. Now, let's take a look at, uh, at the server. Uh, all right, so I'm going to run the server right here and open up this marketplace in the browser. So it's right here. It's up and running. And now we can start focusing on the specifics for Cavon. So it's time to go back to the code and start making some changes. So say, for instance, that placeholder text we just saw, uh, we should probably say something different, like book unique places to stay around the globe. Save. And that's it. It's updated. So isn't that really awesome? Like We went from nothing to having an actual marketplace with the ability to onboard sellers, accept payments, and set payouts in what? Maybe just right over two minutes. Obviously, that sample is inspired by one of the most successful marketplaces in the world. But of course, you can use it to build any kind of platform, not just rental uh, for homes. Because Connect marketplaces are built on the global payments and treasury network that Will described, we can go global on day one. We're using Express to quickly onboard uh, homeowners with our branded onboarding flow. Laura owns a house in Singapore, and she wants to be our first host, so let's test our onboarding to our service. With Express, we can quickly collect the info we'll need to pay our homeowners. And these firms are localized, they're mobile friendly, and most importantly, they request only the minimum details in every country. So here we're going to use a test code. If I were to switch my locale right here, for instance, you would see all of that translated in Chinese. So I'm going to fill in a home address, a tax ID, click Next. And finally, the last step for Laura will be to specify how she'd like to get paid. So in this case, we're just going to use a test bank account for now. And that's it. We're ready to back to the site, and Laura is ready to list a home. Let's just think about that for a second. Like We just onboarded a user in Singapore with everything localized, from the date formatting to the regex for the tax ID. Did you really want to build that for Singapore yourself on top of all the other 30 markets that you might want to go into? Luckily, Stripe handles most of the hard work for us here. And with our great developer tools, we can now use Connect from any entry point to Stripe's infrastructure, the dashboard, the API, and even the CLI now. And I guess we're done with a minute to spare. <laughs>